COVID-19 pandemic has put many of our favorite summer activities on hold. But there is some good news. The Fargo Food drive through only food truck festival has now rolled its way into town. And that's where we find the valley today is Callie Hubbard. She joins us live as she's eating her way through the morning. Hi there, Callie. Hi, yeah, difficult morning, right, Lisa and Jordan? In a few short hours, people are going to be making their way and enjoying so many delicious foods that they're going to be having at this food truck festival. It's a little bit different this year. It's pandemic friendly, and I've been here all morning just kind of talking about what people like John Lindquist with Jumbo Sloppy Joes is doing. He has this plexiglass ready here, the mask and the gloves ready to make some food, and we're standing in front of some of the food that he's already created. I guess kind of tell us what we have here. Sure, absolutely. We've got our famous Jumbo's Mac and Joe right there. Uh, homemade mac and cheese, your choice of original or jalapeno sloppy joe, and then just because we can do it, we add more cheese on top. Oh, love that. And then this was, um, this is the Hollywood? Hollywood Hustle, and that Hollywood is Hustle. in honor of our good friend Jay Halverson. Uh, that is uh, smoked pulled pork with topped with uh, mac and cheese. And then just a little bit more shredded cheese because we can. You definitely need a knife and fork in order to finish that one off. Perfect. We're going to do that kind of as we're talking here. This isn't how I would normally eat a sloppy joe. So if my dad is watching this, he'd be disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> but um, we're going to cut this up. Do you want to take a bite with me? or? Absolutely. I can cut one up right here too. Perfect. And then I also kind of wanted to mention too, there's these vouchers um, that you can mm -hmm. do. You can pay $5 forward to a healthcare worker, to a policeman. Um, that as well. Absolutely. And, uh, you know, there's there's a lot of folks who were definitely essential during this whole thing, who yeah. couldn't take time off, who had to be in the face of danger. Yeah. And uh, we definitely want to thank them. So, as you mentioned, postal workers, police officers, healthcare professionals, um, folks can go ahead and pay a $5 voucher for somebody's meal who's been essential and and who's been helping us through this whole pandemic. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us this morning, you John. Bet. Yeah, you definitely got to head out and try some of this. It's okay, we're just going to take it. She's going to eat and we're going to take it back. <laughs> yeah, right. You know, she has a tough, tough assignment. Job. Callie, thank you very much this morning. But let's get